Hey guys, it's Nikki back on my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a quick and easy capo. So this is my capo that I purchased and what a capo is, is it's a tool that guitarists use and they clip it onto a fret of their guitar to easily change the tuning. It makes the sounds of the strings a little bit higher without having to mess with the tuning pegs. So I bought mine at Target and it was really cheap. I really like it. I've had it for about a year now. But let's say I had my capo with me, needed to perform, and I lost it. So I'm going to show you how to make a really quick capo. So what you need is a pencil and three elastics or rubber bands. So what I do is I take my pencil and I put it on the desired fret of the guitar and I take an elastic, loop it around one end, I slide the pencil back so I can easily pull the other elastic and put it on. And when I put the elastic on, before I put it on, I twist it to create almost this figure eight shape. And that helps to really hold the pencil in place. So as you can see, I have them twisted on the back in the figure eight shape. So depending on how the strings sound, you might need to add more than one elastic. And again, you can use rubber bands however you want. So if the strings sound a little bit scratchy to you or they don't really sound right, I recommend adding more than that. I wouldn't use more than four, I'd say, because then you can seriously hurt your guitar. You don't want to apply that much pressure. So I'm liking how it sounds. It doesn't sound scratchy. I'm just adjusting where I have it and the strings sound pretty good. So I'm going to test out my riff with them. how that sounded so thank you guys for watching and please let me know if you make this DIY capo it's super helpful it's what I used before I bought my capo and before you buy your capo try out a normal set, normal capo so that you know how it feels and by the way guys if you want my music that I have in my videos you can check it out on bensound.com bye